Forensics ran it through the system. Found it was stolen from the stacked deck a few weeks ago. I recognize it. It's been customized since then. My drone can analyze it. Just point and I'll shoot. Get some details on this paint. Funny. Doesn't look like a rush job. Because it's not. The drone sees a body shop quality strip below the top layer. The paint uses a stripping solvent that hasn't met compliance standards since... I'll run a check on manufacturers in the area, see who's recently been dinged for safety regulations. This much data, we're gonna need something to narrow it down. Like a name. Kids are natural at this. Hmm. Someone was thirsty. What do you think? Wanna run DNA? No. We already know who it belongs to. Huh. This car is hotwired. It's a mess. Well, you think a guy like him would have stolen a car before? He's unconventional. That's one way to put it. Custom plates. Probably didn't get this done at the DMV. Lil Puddin? Must be his way of remembering his time with Harley. <sighs> I miss this, you know. You and me raking over a crime scene? Oh, I messed it up, didn't I? Now, in the early days when we were chasing you, not realizing you were one of the good guys, you and I came to an agreement. We'd work together to make Gotham safer. I lost my head the other day. I want you to know I'm sorry. I cracked, like I said I would when Waller first moved in. Are you done with your trip down memory lane? Because we should get back to work. If that's how you want it, fine. Don't expect another olive branch from me. Got something interesting. It's a faint signal. Drone. Bane's venom. His suit was punctured. It's everywhere. Is it useful? No. Not in finding Joker. I'll add it to ignore on the drone search filters. Nothing of note. Festive, but not a lead. Welcome, Agency Pigs. <laughs> You're right, I thought that was our nickname. Hmm. Not sure Riddler would like the new decor. This Joker guy going nuts. I heard it started with Riddler's murder, but he's blaming Waller for it. Wouldn't actually surprise me. Riddler's murder? Really? But maybe it was always just a matter of time before he snapped. Maker's Mark. W.D. Willie Deaver, Joker's associate. What do you have on him? Machinist by trade, with a storied employment history. He's been fired from almost every factory and chemical plant in Gotham. Has a drinking problem, apparently. Chemical plants? Huh. Let me cross-reference Willie Deaver's former employers with the paint used on Joker's car. Ace Chemicals. Their main plant was shut down last year after the city cited them for multiple safety violations. Because of the paint. The plant's been abandoned ever since. Perfect hiding spot. We found him. Well, well, well. What's all this then? A bat and a walking mustache trespassing on my crime scene. You escaped. <laughs> You got it all wrong, baddie boy. I'm here on agency business. <sighs> For the love of God. That's right. I'm one of the good guys now. So hand over everything you found before I knock out those pearly whites. 
In the name of the law. Batman, we don't have time to mess around with this clown. Make time, Kappa. You all take orders from me now. I don't take orders from you, Quinn. Stand down. Let me show you how things work around here now, Batsy. This is Agent Quinn, suppressing fire. convinced I can save their director from Big Bad Joker. They'll do anything for me. So all you gotta do is tell me where John took her so I can get back to my job. After all, Johnny Boy and I are due for a nice long talk. Poor guy's falling in with the wrong crowd. You don't have a hold over him anymore, Harley. He's over you. He's over me? Oh, please. And here I thought being diplomatic would work with you people. Oh well, I'll try something you can understand. I need to... uh, hey, you cops can't just shoot people like that. I'm off duty. Hello? What's a girl gotta do to get some fire? Hack those collars in my sleep. <sighs> you son of a Latoya. Got it, sir. you're doing sending you off to Blackgate where you belong <laughs> oh please the agency isn't gonna let me sit in a cell I'm an asset I'm gonna get what I want and there's not a damn thing you can do about it even if you escape this you'll never be free I will hunt you down until you pay for everything you've done you don't scare me I've outrun you before I'll do it again Go find Joker before he carves up Waller. I'll clean up this mess. Have your people hold back until I call them. Waller's life may depend on a stealthy approach. <laughs> Batman. Good hunting. on Joker and Waller. Doesn't look like he's hurt her. Not yet. I'm in the rafters, out of sight. Say the word if you need help. Thanks. Bruce, I know you and Waller have your differences, but she doesn't deserve this. I take complete responsibility. Louder. So the camera can pick it up. Took you long enough. Batman! 
Thank God! I mean, I assumed you'd be okay. You're Batman, for Pete's sake. But still, are you okay, buddy? I was really worried about you. This needs to stop. Let Waller go. I know things got a little out of hand. I had to do something. Waller was about to walk away. But get this. I'm this close to getting Waller to admit to every terrible thing she's ever done. And when that's over, I'll deliver her punishment. It'll, of course, have to reflect the enormity of her crimes. The only enormity I'm seeing is your jail sentence. Waller needs to go to trial. Maybe spend the rest of her life in a cell. But not whatever this is. Do you know how long that would take? <laughs> You know, I... I don't know why you're not more into this. Think of everything she's put you through! Everyone is disposable to her! Even her own agents! I know I've made mistakes. You try to do the right thing, but there's always a cost. Just ask your pal Batman there. He'll say the same thing. I do what I do for a reason. I'm not ashamed. You do it for yourself. You didn't want that virus to keep people safe. You wanted to use it to advance your career. My career is how I keep people safe. I fight- You're totally right. She sucks! Let's keep the show rolling. We've heard your excuses. You didn't mean for people to get hurt. Collateral damage, yada yada yada. But there's one crime that can't be excused. You killed the Riddler! And then you tried to pin it on me! I didn't kill him, like I said. It was you! You killed Riddler! Say it! I will not. If there's one thing I learned by watching you, violence solves a lot of problems! Distraction. Well, I get my confession. The way Boss talked about you, I thought you'd be bigger. your way. I want to just slice her throat right here, right now. I can see that you're trying, but this isn't the way. Don't cuddle me! You're just saying things, trying to trip me up. Just like Lawler. She justifies her crimes, says they're for the greater good, just like you. You both use that word. Justice! As an excuse! So you can do whatever you want! I thought you and I were two threads in the same stitch! I am justice! What I do keeps Gotham from becoming the swamp it once was. I've given everything to protect this city. Delusions of grandeur much! Yet another thing you have in common with Waller! Trying to do things your way was a mistake. Waller killed Riddler. <gasps> and she deserved death! It wasn't Waller! Tiffany? I can't let someone else pay for my crimes. Waller didn't kill Riddler. I did. I know it was wrong. Now. Oh God, are you kidding me? These... ARE THE PEOPLE YOU WANT TO PROTECT! <laughs> I should kill them BOTH! EVERYONE HERE IS GUILTY! <laughs> this is a, this is a joke! Leave them out of this, Joker. 
This is about you and me. Tell that to your distraction over there! I used a drone and these. There's your proof. You want to sacrifice yourself for Waller? Then go ahead! <laughs> Just hold on. Murder is wrong. Trust the system. Violence isn't the answer. People just pick and choose what they believe. And you're no different. I've got her! He's down! Hands where we can see them! After everything we've been through together, this is how it ends. Ooh. Stay down. Please. It's over. Huh. That's your best pep talk. Just give up on your dreams. Stand for nothing. I believed in you, Batman. Like I never believed in anything. And it was all a lie! <laughs> John. <laughs> it's Joker! <laughs> That's enough!
I think the circumstances allow. Gordon was telling me how you found me. Sounds like top drawer detective work. It was a team effort. Batman led the charge. It's not easy to say this, but it looks like you saved my life. I guess that puts me in your debt. Doesn't make you special, Waller. It certainly doesn't mean I like you. Jim, would you mind giving us a minute? Batman and I have some unfinished business. I'll go check on Joker's transfer, make sure they don't take any chances. Just try not to rip each other's heads off, okay? We can all play nice now that the bad guy's in cuffs. You don't have to worry. Our stalemate from the roof still stands. I'm pulling out of Gotham effective immediately. Then why are we still talking? Tiffany Fox. Riddler's death may have caused a lot of problems, but I won't make her pay for it. I'll leave that to the man who can't stand killing. I know you think I'm the devil, but I want you to understand. I didn't want... I didn't see things going down like this. I let the mission get out from under me. Never really regained a solid footing. Watch out, Waller. Or you might stumble onto an actual apology. You let me talk, we might get there. I just came here to round up the pact. Quick and easy. And if Riddler led you to Sanctus, that would have been a bonus. Listen. Everything I did, I did for the greater good. To protect Gotham, to uphold the law, to make the world a safer place. You're so full of it. You caused all of this. I've seen the file. The Pact would never have come to Gotham if you hadn't kept Lotus running. Take a look in the goddamn mirror. I'm owning my part in this. But what about you? You act so high and mighty. At the end of the day, you're just a rich guy with all the toys beating up on lunatics. I deal with criminals who threaten my city. You're so far up your own ass, you can't see the truth. 
You're as nuts as any of them. Avesta had you pegged the minute she walked in your office. She started listing off your pals. All those friends of yours who went cuckoo. How do you think I catch them? I need to be to do what I do. I'd have to agree. We're done here. Signal the withdrawal. I'm not gonna miss her, that's for sure. So, here we are, once again. Gotham safe because of you. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it felt pretty good getting my hands dirty. Just like old times, huh? Truth is, after I got ousted, I didn't know my place anymore. Turned into an old guy in civvies, lurking around crime scenes. We have to work together, Jim. Solve cases. Lock up the scum who terrorize our streets. Oh, I'm surprised. You didn't seem all that keen on hearing my apology before. I thought our thing was over. I'm glad I was wrong. Oh, uh, I gotta take this. Wife probably saw the news. <laughs> See you around, Batman. Don't be a stranger. Tiffany, we need to talk. Yeah, I figured. You're hurt. It's nothing. I saw you take much worse. Joker was going to cut Waller ear to ear. I had to create a distraction. It was certainly distracting. My confession. It took you by surprise, didn't it? I just couldn't keep it in anymore. You know I don't condone killing. Not even scum like Riddler. I've been dreading this moment. Especially since I learned who you are under that mask. I was afraid of what might happen if you found out. I guess I was hoping you never would. Why didn't you talk to me sooner? I... I wanted to work with you, to be part of your mission. But you kept this from me. A murder? I know. I'm sorry. I knew this would ruin everything. You were right. Riddler tore my family apart, Bruce. My mother hasn't left the house since the funeral. And Luke? He just lashes out. My father's death broke them. It broke all of us. I won't ask for forgiveness. But I hope you can understand why I had to do it. I just felt so powerless. Like my life was crumbling around me. I had to do something to take back control. Revenge is an impulse, one to be checked. I can't condone it. But I do understand it. Thank you. That means a lot. I couldn't bear it if you despised me. So, where do we go from here? I suppose this puts me on your most wanted list. Rather than us working together. If you want to fill your father's shoes, you need to learn right from wrong. You need someone to teach you. you you're giving me a second chance? 
Think of it more as a sentence. You'll have to work hard for your redemption. I promise I won't let you down. Then let's get started. I was going to write a note, but I'm not a coward. At least I don't want to be. Not anymore. Then again, this won't be the first time I've found my courage in a single malt. Courage for what? Saying goodbye. I'm leaving, Bruce. It's time I went in search of better pastures. You just need rest, Alfred. Why don't you take a long vacation? Like we talked about. Some place in the sun, and on the other side of the world from Gotham. I rather think this vacation will be permanent. But why? This war of ours is not what it was when we started. I no longer have the stomach for it. It's not sustainable. At least not for me. So... Take a back seat from the operations. Put your feet up for a while. Keep us stocked with cucumber sandwiches and tea. And just stand idly by while your enemies rend you limb from limb. Do a little dusting while you bleed out on the Batcave floor. I don't think so. Our mission used to be so clear. Catch the criminals, lock them up. But nothing is clear anymore. At least not to me. Now everything has become so gray. Ray, talk to me, Alfred. We used John Doe, exploited his friendship to get you into the pact. We took advantage of someone you met in an asylum, for God's sake. Someone clearly challenged with a proven tendency to violence. Well, it worked, didn't it? In a manner of speaking. You empowered John Doe, kept him close when you should have put him away. Inspired him to become something far more dangerous than he ever was. What's your point? Sometimes, it's as if Batman creates the evil he means to destroy. For all our good intentions, I fear we only make things worse. A dreadful thought, I know. But one that keeps me awake at night. I'm not blind to the damage I cause. Nor am I to the chaos that swirls in Gotham. But I have to believe the good outweighs the bad. I thought you did too. Not anymore. Anyone who comes into contact with us suffers. Lucius is gone. Tiffany has blood on her hands. I foolishly thought bringing her in might make things better. As if her enthusiasm might remind us how things were in the beginning. We put her in danger on her first day, dodging machine guns at a crime scene. The lives we touch are touched by pain. Friends, colleagues, innocents. No one is spared. That's a price I'm willing to pay. In war, there are always casualties. But it doesn't mean you give up the fight. I've served in my share of wars, Bruce. More even than you. There are some fights you cannot win. One thing is for certain. My tremors are gone. <laughs> That's great news, Al. They stopped the minute I made the decision to go. I thought it was the kidnapping with Lady Arkham that caused them. Some kind of residual trauma. But I had it wrong. This sense of powerlessness I've been feeling, it came from something I saw in you. The tremors, the fainting spells, all of it. Alfred, I'm... I'm so sorry. I've caused you so much pain. No, no, please, don't misunderstand me. Let me explain. Your father was driven by an obsession, by a need to control. He rushed headlong into the darkness, 
thinking himself invincible, oblivious to the cost. Just like you, not like me. I chase that darkness away. And yet, history is repeating itself. I'm more certain of that with every passing day. Alfred, these comparisons... You knew the evil my father was capable of. You think you see that in me? I said nothing about evil, Bruce. Then what are you saying? I'm saying you'll end up in the same place. Face down in an alley. Shot in the dark by criminals in some godforsaken corner of Gotham. I won't be witness to that. I won't bury you, too. I stood by and did nothing while Thomas destroyed himself, along with everything he loved. I enabled him, like I'd been enabling you. Realizing this, I've never felt so helpless. I wanted things to be different for you, my boy. You deserved a better life than the one I gave you. I failed you, and for that I'm sorry. You did the best you could, Al. In a single night, the family was shattered, and you were left to pick up the pieces. I may have picked them up, but I did a poor job sticking them back together. Well, I don't want to miss my flight. There's always traffic around the airport. You don't have to do it, Bruce. There are other ways of doing good in the world. But you, you pour everything into your bloody crusade. And I know you too well to hope you'll ever change. who I am. I will always be Batman. And that will never change. I know. Rubbish goes out on Tuesday, and there's lasagna in the freezer. I'm sure you'll manage. You got that look in your eye, the kind that says you're trouble. Thunderbolt? I'm the whole goddamn hurricane! Gotham's safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! I weighed my options, and what can I say? I don't like to lose. I won't let you down. The criminally insane. You're drawn to them, aren't you? If a man hides in plain sight for that long, does he forget who he really is? We're two threads in the same stitch, bound together, even under strain.
visitor for John Doe. 